In this video, I'm going to show you how you can add, remove, resize, and reposition panes within the WinPlus IP GUI. So first of all, I'm going to add a couple of panes. So I'm going to click on Window, and I'm going to add Run Orders. And then I'm going to click on Window, and I'm going to add Controller. So the two panes that I've just added have positioned themselves here, Run Orders, and here, Controller. If I'd like to reposition these, there's a number of ways of doing this. First of all, I just click in the title bar of the pane, and then I can drag this window. Or I can pin this window to a toolbar on the side of the GUI. I do this by clicking on the pin icon. This will auto hide this window, but won't close it. You see that the run orders window is now in the sidebar. If I hover over it and click, it will show me the contents of that window. If I want to return it back to where it was, I click on the pin button again. I can resize the windows at any time just by dragging. I'd now like to move the run orders window, so I will click in the title bar I can now drag this window, and whenever I position it over another window, I'm given a guide to show me where this window will be placed when I release it. So for example, if I hover over the top icon, it shows me that the run orders window will be pinned at the top of the story editor window. At the bottom, it will be below, to the left, or to the right. If I hover over the center window and I release it, it will now be tabbed along with the story editor window. To release this window from being tabbed again, if I click on the down arrow in the title bar and float, it will now separate it from the story editor window and now I can position it elsewhere. There is a default GUI layout which is set within WinPlus IP. If I show you how we apply that, if we move some windows to put them into different positions, If you now want to revert back to the original layout, which is the standard WinPlus IP GUI layout, you click on Window, and then Restore Layout to Default, and that will then reposition all the windows to the default layout. 